how to quickly download content from your GoPro to your iPad Pro, the fastest way to do it with the fewest steps. First off, we all know that you can use the GoPro app on your iPad. Simply log in and you can connect your iPad via Wi-Fi and download any content you want using the Wi-Fi connectivity and the Bluetooth connectivity between the devices. That may be the most common way that folks do that, but there's a faster way to get it done and I want to show you how to get it done coming up next. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. So you're going to connect this via the USB-C port on the side of your iPad Pro and using the USB-C port on the side of your GoPro. So what you want to do is get yourself one of these USB-C to USB-C cables that you can find on Amazon Basic. So just simple USB-C to USB-C. It's about a two foot cable and it works perfect. First thing you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and plug that in to the side of your iPad Pro. And then you're going to plug it into the side of your GoPro, like so. Occasionally your iPad will open your photos when you do that, but if it doesn't, don't worry about it. As soon as you power on your GoPro, your iPad's going to recognize it and automatically open your importer within your iPad. From there, go ahead and set your camera aside and you'll see the content that is now on your iPad, or I'm sorry, on your GoPro. And you're just going to either import all up here, or you're going to import selected. So for this example, I'm going to choose this one video and I'm gonna choose this photo and I'll choose this photo, okay? Back up to the importer, but before you import, stop over here and choose the library on your iPad that you want to import to. So I'm going to go ahead and import it to my GoPro album, and then I'll slide back over here and import. At this point, it's asking me, do I want to import all or and skip duplicates? I have no all at this point. So I could go ahead and import all or, or get rid of duplicates. But I'm choosing every photo and every video. If I don't choose every photo and every video and I go back up to import, then it's going to say import all or import selected. So in this example, I'm going to import selected. As soon as I tap that, you can see right away the photo came over as indicated by the green check mark. And there's your video. So you can see how much faster that is via versus Wi-Fi. And then in the center here, it's asking me, do I want to delete them off my GoPro or keep them? So for the sake of this demonstration, I'm going to keep it. So those photos are still on my GoPro. Now, not only is this faster, but there's less steps as compared to using your the GoPro app because the GoPro app requires you first to download from the, the GoPro to the app, and then from the app to your photo roll. So by plugging into the side like this, you're downloading directly to your photo roll, and now when you go over to your photos, those videos and those photos are all ready on my iPad, ready for me to work with. So the USB-C connector is faster, and there's less steps. Hope you found this helpful. Thanks for watching.